Hey guys, you're Marta Geek. In this video, I'm playing a little bit more of Zelda Breath of the Wild, which looks gorgeous here on the Nintendo Switch. Um, like you see here, I already got very cool equipment there, nice looking suit. I tinted in red. But here, we arrived to this island. It's called Eventide Island. And I really like what happened once you get to this island. So I, I, I decided, you know what, let me go ahead and record it because it's like uh, a fresh new start and, I, and now you're gonna see why you so you're gonna get this message right away you know spoilers you know if you want if you want to keep on watching just keep on reading there uh, you see this telling you okay i know you got all this equipment and all that but now that you're in this island you're gonna have to you know go through some challenges and look what happens boom Link is stripped out of all his gear. So now I have to get three orbs and put it in some altars. So then I could get my, I might get like a, a prize or something. I don't know. Maybe. But like you see here, we're totally stripped. We have nothing. Just our little tablet there. And um, here is the island. The, this is the current location right there. Like you see there. Um, here. I, I still need to unlock a lot of stuff here in, the, in Zelda. I actually have a lot of the location visited, but I haven't like gone to those towers where it exposes the whole map. Yeah, I've been kind of lazy. I've been too distracted doing so many awesome sh crap in this game. Uh, here we got orange shell crabs. There's a lot of cool crabs here in on this island. Uh, you got to lift, look at that, bright eyed crab. So, like, so there, there was an, an altar right there, but I just want to go over here first. I did start this game already. This section right here, like, three times already, and I died. And I said, you know what, let me go ahead and record it a little bit, so that way I can share with you guys a little bit of gameplay. And this is the first time I record gameplay using uh, the game card. But look at here, you still have these options right here, which is good. There's a oh, oh, look at that. Now that's the first time it didn't actually, it didn't actually stay on the freaking big ass cube. <laughs> okay, now let's see. Here we can actually open it. Yeah, we, we can actually open it from here. So we got five arrows. And I gotta say, this game looks gorgeous here on the TV. After I did a couple adjustments. Because I've been getting a lot of tips on my YouTube videos, for example, the Zelda, especially Zelda. Uh, to go to TV settings, and in TV settings, there's a automatic RGB. And an automatic RGB, instead of leaving it automatic, just change it to full RGB. Then on the game capture, oh shit, look at this. Wow, this is the first time I see... You. What the hell? Those are holy crap. What the what the hell was those are crabs or rocks? Get out of here. <laughs> okay, so look at that. We got some bananas. So yeah, that's the good thing about this island. Yeah, you start totally stripped, totally naked, but what the hell? Those are rocks. <laughs> Man, every time I get surprised about about this game. Every time. Every time I, I turn this game on, I, I, I'm just... Oh my god. I'm just distracted with something else that I see in this world. Uh, let's go ahead and try to show you guys as much gameplay. I don't think I'm going to show you guys the whole... Oh yeah, there you go. Holy crap, how did that <laughs> Oh they hit they they hit the they hit the palm tree and it exploded in their face. <laughs> that was really nice. That was really nice. Okay, so yeah, you, like see here right away we could get some weapons here that we can use to defend ourselves. We got some wood there. Uh, we could use this for that 
inside these crates there's gonna be some cool stuff as well uh, let's go and drop it and there you go a volt fruit hydro melon damn that's awesome okay traveler sword there you go we already got a freaking weapon there you go and we got some arrows and we got a shield yeah, there you go not that bad at first it was intimidating when they started I was like what you taking everything away from me but then I when, when I started you know going through the island I just noticed oh there you go there you go another razor claw crab oh this since we're still literally naked or strict I still try to avoid you know confrontations that way when I have enough oh look at the lizard right there oh, the hell. okay well look at that another lizard there holy crap where this bull came from <laughs> okay we got a, a bull and a goat there <laughs> So yeah, what I was saying, oh look at this, and we got that other beast, we got a beat later on. So that's why I'm telling you, that's why at first you have to try to avoid as much challenges or, or matches, confrontations, because you want to leave that beast for the, for the end, that's the Hinox. Boom! There you go. Perfect timing. <laughs> Man, having this is a huge advantage. There you go. Yellow choo-choo jelly. So later on, that's gonna be good for making um, food. That's gonna be that's gonna give you like resistant to electricity. Okay, we got some more here. There you go. There we go. We keep finding a lot of stuff there. Let's, let eat, let's eat some apples here. We haven't been able to cook yet here in this island. There you go. Oh crap, seriously? What? I thought I freaking killed these suckers. Oh. <laughs> Come over here. There you go. <laughs> there you go. There you go. We got some seared steaks. Kidding me? There's another guy behind me. Who's behind me? Another. There you go. <laughs> so yes, you can start a fire there. I could start a fire, but I don't have the. I think it's the flint. I have the wood, but I don't have the. Yeah. You see there, I don't have the, I think it's the flints that you use, the little, the rocks that spark. But I don't have, so I can't start anything there so I can cook. I got crappy ass swords, traveler swords. And uh, let's see if I wake that guy up. Wake up! <laughs> You know, this game, I'm telling you, is incredible. Because um, you can basically interact with anything. Anything in this world you can interact with. Here, over here, we got some... 
rocks hidden there, so we could go blow this up. Oof. There you go. <laughs> and uh, there you go. Look at that. Soldier spear. Your inventory is full? What the hell you mean inventory is full? I'll strip naked. Okay, I'll have a whole bunch of crap here. Uh, drop it. There you go. That should be enough. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's so awesome. There you go. So now I got a nice looking spear there. I'm gonna change it to the Traveler Sword. And uh, let's go up here. There's a couple enemies. Like I say, you should, for, in, my, in my opinion, you should leave the Hinox, which is the big, the big creature right there. You should leave it for the end because he has the last orb. He has one of the orbs, not the last orbs. He has one of the orbs that you need. So you might as well leave it for the end. Yeah, you have to come here because there's another orb over there. Let's go throw this over there. There you go. Okay. Come on. Oh man, I was hoping they blew up with them. Oh man, I was hoping. Let's get the hell out of here. There you go. <laughs> oh man, I was hoping I hit the 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 barrel. There you go. Oh, that's that looks incredible. That looks incredible. I, I'm sorry, but that looks incredible. There you go. <laughs> so yeah, that's basically my strategy here. Just keep running away and uh, use keep using these. Because the great thing about these is that they're unlimited. That's the huge advantage of those, these exploding runes, I think it's called. There you go, we got a soldier's bow. And now we can use our bow. We got some arrows here. <laughs> you ain't using your freaking horn anymore, huh? There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait. Hey, 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 hey. Keep running. Keep running. Like I said, I don't you don't want to use your even though I have weapons I can use right now, you want to try to avoid using those weapons cuz you're going to need them later on. So, as long as you can use these explosives, just keep on using them cuz they're unlimited. <laughs> Oh, oh, right, come over here, boy. Come over here, boy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Holy crap. One swing and I'm dead. <laughs> There's the orb right there. Oh, yeah. I think this one's dead. Still got that fucker. Yep. Uh huh. <laughs> Ooh. And uh, the thing about this game also is that I've been playing it like, wow, I would say almost a hundred percent on the Nintendo Switch via mobile. That's the way I've been playing this game. I have. I barely, 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 barely use the Nintendo Switch as a full console. And sometimes I'm wondering how is most people playing the Nintendo Switch as a console or as a mobile device? Because for me, the Nintendo Switch has been my mobile device. Not, uh, not even, I'm not, it's a console, but I, I'm not using it 
at all as a console. Here I'm using it as a console because I'm recording gameplay for you guys using the game capture Elgato, which is the one that I use. There you go. There you go. Oh yeah, soldier's shield. We got a soldier's shield. We got another sword that we should eliminate one of these crappy ass woods. <laughs> Sticks. We got a torch there too. We got this. Let's go ahead and drop that. Let's make that sword. We could start a fire there too, but it's also raining. Doesn't really matter. And we got that sword. Uh oh. That sword is about to get hit by lightning. I'm going to change to a wooden weapon. That's a great thing about this game too. You know, when it's... Okay, there I go ahead and edited that because I couldn't figure out how to take this out. <laughs> there you go. There you go. I barely use that freeze effect so yeah oh, uh oh wait a second wait a second wait a second wait a second change it okay this is what's causing okay the shield <laughs> there you go wow I could have got hit by lightning there that's a cool thing about this game you know the weather even even reacts to whatever the hell you're using. There you go. You need to put that there. Come on. <laughs> so yeah, we gotta put. Holy crap! Wait a second. The lightning just hit near me. <laughs> so yeah, that orb goes right there. I'm trying to push it. I guess I can't freaking push it and I god damn it I got inside the freaking hole. <laughs> Get right there. There you go. So that's what we gotta do in this island. Uh -huh. Okay now waited for the I waited for the thunder to go because, you know, I couldn't climb these rocks, which I was curious because they, it really sticks out. So that that's the cool thing about this game also, that, you know, the weather affects the way you can play as well. Like, there's no way you're going to climb this if it's raining. Unless, I think there's like a, a suit or a... A costume, whatever you want to call it, that you can actually climb when it's raining, but I don't have that. And of course, we're stripped out. Even if I did have it, it would have been useless right now. Okay. So, hmm, what a bummer. There is nothing up here unless I'm missing something. There's a nice, beautiful view. Yeah, nice beautiful view. That's where we were at over there. Yeah, it looks gorgeous. But there's nothing here. God damn it, seriously? Yeah. Wow, I was hoping something special was up here. There was absolutely nothing. Huh. Okay, look at this. We also have our paraglider. And uh, there's another orb over here. There we go. It's going to land right here. There you go. The orb right here. Whoa. <laughs> 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 Gotta be careful. 
careful because right now we don't have. There you go. Bing! Headshot! <laughs> Let's see what we got here. There you go, another soldier's bow. So now I got two of them. All I need is arrows. Is there something over here? Uh, a cheap ass bow. Man, I need arrow arrows. And okay. So, let's see. There's a base or a altar over there, but it, I forgot you can't run with the freaking orb. <laughs> now the shroom. Yeah, that's the problem with this. When you're carrying this stuff, you can't freaking run or he'll just drop it. There's a goblin alive over there. But I'm gonna try to avoid him. Uh oh. Try to avoid these for now. Oh, seriously? Try to avoid that suckers too. So, yeah, guys, I wonder. You guys that have the Nintendo Switch, how are you using your Nintendo Switch? Are you using it mainly as your console? Connected in console mode on your TV? Or are you playing this the Nintendo Switch mainly as a mobile device? Please guys, let me know. And are you replacing your Nintendo 3DS? Or are you replacing a PlayStation Vita? <laughs> There's a lot of people doing that. <laughs> but here, come come on, man. Come on, get in there. There you go. So we got two. We got two. And I think this is it for now for this video. Because I don't think you know, it's going to take me a while before I kill this sucker. And the video is already long enough. But... I just wanted to share this video with you guys so you guys can have an idea what to expect when you go to this island. Mark it up. Put it put a pin on your map if you want to go to this section of the island of this map cuz I think it's freaking awesome. You know, you ha when you arrive here, you're surprised with this challenge that you have to complete cuz they take away everything and you won't be able to to leave the island, I, I'm pretty sure you can't leave the island and recoup everything. You have to actually complete this if you want to get all your stuff back. And there you go. So there's Hinox. 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 Which, of course, you gotta shoot him in the eye a couple times with the arrow. But after you shoot him a couple times in the air on the on his eyes, he starts covering his eyes he knows that you're gonna shoot him so after two or three hits uh, the arrows become useless because you won't be able to hit him in the eyes anymore because I ran out of freaking arrows <laughs> yeah but like I said once you get this last orb we're gonna be able to complete our challenge and get out of the eye get our stuff back and who knows we might get some surprise as well so guys, I'm going to end the video here. Thanks for watching my gameplay. Till next time, guys.